Hi guys, my name is Tabu Mahano from UNISA from the College of Economic Management Sciences and over the next couple of weeks we're going to be running an educational series where we're helping our graduates who are currently looking to step into the job market on how they can beef up their CVs and create an advantage when they're going into the job market and we've partnered with Express Employment Professionals and over the next couple of weeks we're going to be embraced by Tinsualo who's going to be sharing powerful, powerful nuggets with us. Thank you for joining us, Tinsualo. Welcome. Thank you for having me, Tawo. I'm very excited to be here and I can't wait to share all the info. I think it's going to help a lot of graduates and applicants. No, we are looking forward to learning from you. So, Tinsualo, to start right off, you know, a lot of us who go to university and we make it all about the qualification. You know, all you're focusing on your grades, making sure that you're passing. Is that what it's all about? Look, it's great to pass and it's certainly great to have uh, high marks. But at the end of the day, um, in today's world, when you look at a job posting in a day or two, say on LinkedIn, you already see this like hundreds of applicants. And if you mm. think about it, out of the hundreds of applicants, most of them generally meet the minimum requirements, right? But it's about who exactly stands out. So especially if it's a graduate program that you're applying for, Everybody has the degree that is required, but who stands out? And your high marks are great, but they're not always the only thing that matters. There needs to be sets of skills that show that you're going to add value. And I think as I'm saying this, some of the students or the graduates watching right now, they're like, what skills are these? Because no, don't have work experience and all of that. It's fine. It's fine. That's exactly why we're having the series so we can educate you on those skills. So in this video series, we aim to talk about communication skills. This is a critical skill that everybody needs to have. And we're then going to talk about another set of skills in which communication skills is actually a part of, but we want to highlight it separately, and this is transferable skills. How you can start gaining some transferable skills that will help you stand out. Then after talking about transferable skills, we're going to cover a very important topic that also on its own can make a huge difference in your job journey, and that is having a positive outlook. We're going to talk about that extensively. Then afterwards, we're going to look at how now you can create opportunities for yourself to actually gain work experience and to gain these skills that we're talking about. And this is by getting involved in your community, volunteering. We're going to talk about that. And I'm pretty sure as you volunteer and you get involved in your community, in your community you'll have some things you're proud of. So then we're going to talk about accomplishments. How can you highlight those accomplishments in your CV, during your interview, so that you can stand out? Then to put it all together, we're going to then talk about how you can put together a CV that will set you up for success, that can help you stand out. So I'm really, really excited about this job series. I really want to see you all there because this is for you. If you're in a job journey, this is for you. Wow, it definitely sounds like we're going to learn a lot from you. And, you know, as they say, information is power. So it's mm -hmm. really important for us to empower our students and empower our graduates with the necessary information in such a time as this. So thank you for joining us this week, Tim Swallow. We're looking forward to learning from you next week as we tackle the first topic on communications. Thank you so much for joining us. Awesome. Thanks for having me. I look forward to it. Thanks, guys. All right. Cheers, Tim Swallow. Guys, make sure you join us next week. Like she said, we're going to jump straight into our first topic on communication and make sure that you follow us throughout the entire series. And as you're learning, as you're, you're, you're watching the series, if you've got any comments, make sure you drop the comments below and we'll be sure to address them. Thank you so much. See you guys next week. Thank <laughs> you.